Okay everyone, today I'm going to be breaking a vacuum chamber underwater. So a few videos ago I opened my vacuum chamber underwater to show people what would happen. And that video was really cool and all, but it left people wanting. They wished that I had smashed the vacuum chamber underwater instead of opening it with just a small hole. So today I thought let's make their dreams come true and smash a vacuum chamber underwater. Do you think that it will just smash and no bubble will come up? It'll just smash into nothing or what will happen? There's only one way to find out. Let's smash a vacuum chamber underwater. Okay, so the vacuum that I'm going to be crushing underwater today is similar to the vacuum that you'll be getting in the Action Lab subscription box. So if you haven't ordered your subscription box, head over to theactionlab.com right now. Click the link in the description and head over to get your Action Lab subscription box. So let's see if we can get to a good vacuum in here. Okay, first let's test out if our vacuum's working. Let's pump out the air. Three, two, one. See the balloon blowing up. Pressure's going down, the balloon's gonna pop. Whoa, <laughs> scared me. <laughs> Okay, so our vacuum chamber definitely works. Okay, so let's go ahead and get this down to as low of a vacuum as we can. Let's stick it under the water and I'm gonna smash it and see what happens. Let's see if an actual bubble forms when it's under the water or it just cracks and the water just rushes in and there's a big boom. Not sure what will happen, but let's check it out. Okay, so the plan is to get it under vacuum and then I'm gonna jab it with this rod when it's fully under vacuum. I'm really nervous to do this. I don't wanna end up with shards of glass in me. But let's see what happens. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Okay, looking back at this slow motion footage, it's even cooler than I thought it would be. So watch what happens when I jam the rod in the water. It carries some air down with it. But as soon as the rod breaks the vacuum, it sucks that little air bubble around the rod into the vacuum chamber and then it explodes. So cool. So the bubbles that you see rising from the water after we smashed the vacuum chamber were actually just from the air that was around the rod when I jammed it into the water. Okay, now that was weird. That was almost silent. I expected a large boom to happen, but actually there was almost no sound whatsoever. Okay, and here's what it looks like with air in it. So this is just a normal jar with air in it. Three, two, one. <laughs> So with that one, you could easily see the big air bubble come up. It even splashed out of the chamber. Remember to head on over to theactionlab.com to sign up for your Action Lab subscription box so you can do all the experiments that you see me do on my channel or just click the link right here to head over to theactionlab.com. And if you're not subscribed yet, remember to hit the subscribe button and hit the bell to be notified when my latest video's out. And thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.